What's good, beautiful people? And today I'm hitting you with something I haven't done in probably over a year. I don't honestly know when this came out, but I finally reloaded Genshin Impact. And you know what? I was like, let me see what I have been missing out on. I used to absolutely adore this game and I kind of want to find a love again, man. This is like an ex. I'm trying to like rekindle that love. So unfortunately, my webcam was not working with this one. Um, OBS was not recording this properly, so I had to go ahead and figure something else out. But nonetheless, man, if you enjoy Genshin content, if you want to see me do more of this, man, make sure you leave a like. And beyond that, enjoy the video, man. Yeah, I kind of gave back and I am in the middle of this scene. Um, so this is the, really the last time I've played Genshin Impact. And I know the arena because I've um, done the boss with a friend before, but um, I actually haven't done the story mission yet. So this should actually be really interesting, like something really interesting to jump back into. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't use my traditional recording methods. I don't know why, because it's Genshin Impact and it's just either way. All right, so this is not gonna be a face scale. And I think that's perfectly fine for like the majority of people. So let's go ahead and continue. Look over where Primate, tell me something. Oh, oh, I thought there was only one. We meet again, Traveler. This hey. body is an assistant to the one within, but it is also the guardian of the rules. Which one's Should talking one to me? Should wish to stray from the rules, this body shall stand in her way. Wait, how uh, okay. Is that the puppet? You have I'm a little bit lost right now. in my body. And you appear to have grasped the true essence of eternity. Yo, you why she got a little bad bitch dance going on? She ready to throw down. Former self. Thus, you believe your present self is correct, don't you? But have you really been enlightened with new ideas? Or have you been degraded by irreversible erosion? I'm here to show um. you my answer. We are both warriors. And the dialogue we must now have shall be conducted by the blade alone. Uh, I mean, all right, cool. Well, I guess this doesn't, it doesn't involve me, right? Y'all got this? The discomfort I was experiencing earlier was caused by the Shogun rejecting my continued use of her body. As she indicates, once I started entertaining the idea of change, I became hostile in her eyes. Okay, it's kind of coming back but to me with that one. Of consciousness, I exist independently of her. I've got A is a boomer. She cannot affect me in this way. Though she is a puppet, the Shogun has her own consciousness too. When necessary, she appears here to confront me. Um, yeah, 100%, yeah. <laughs> I'm sure you have mentioned this before, just it's been a little while, you know? Hi. So we don't get a cutscene or what? The rules I set for the Shogun are... No. The Shogun herself is the manifestation of my past ideals. The very foundation stone of eternity. It shall not be easily swayed. I would not try to change her if it wasn't necessary. Isn't there any other way? Can't you hack it through? I mean, shut up, okay? I want to see the baddies throw down. But they both just want the best for Inazuma. My form is a symbol of supreme majesty in which has been vested power over all the realm. It is the cohesive embodiment of all that constitutes... Oh, God, this dialogue, I don't miss it. Shopping. It inherits A's pain. The pain of inevitable loss that comes as she moves forward. So too does it inherit her determination to reach eternity. Uh -huh. Every action undertaken is for the sake of resisting erosion. Determination, courage, love. All right, so I'm gonna need y'all in the comment section. Um, all of these will be degraded and distorted by the. Explain to me like I'm five, bro. Time. Explain to me like I'm mentally well. For eternity. <laughs> Those were my thoughts when I created you. Now, they are towering obstacles that I have no choice but to overcome. You wish so, to make yourself my enemy? So, bad bitch, throw down? I am your past, the everlasting law, 
the guardian of eternity. It's like, as someone get it, and but I there's a lot of dialogue going on right now. Promised a dream to her subjects. Right an A. Right an A. I like it. <laughs> right an A. I like it, bro. Oh, oh, oh this is me. And oh, so we're gonna fight or what? Oh, okay. Okay. This is kind of dope, though. So we get like a one v one. Okay. What you do? What do you do? Oh. Oh shit. Hey, okay. Okay, okay. Shine down. Yeah, we need some backup for this one though. Alright. She's yo, I can't move. I can't move. I can't move. What's going on? Oh, I switched to walking. That's why. I'm sorry, I'm a noob again, bro. Oh shit. Alright, we got her. There we go. There we go. Oh, damn that damage though. I forgot. I forgot, yo. Freaking this old just what? Oh, okay. Okay, 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 we got it, we got it, we got it. There we go. And finish her. Alright, can I Yo, finish her. Oh, okay. Bad bitch face too, let's go. This is kinda really dope. Um, am I gonna need food? I feel like I'm gonna need food eventually. Okay. Is that a counter? What is that? Oh. Oh god. Oh, come on, bro. With that little defense right there, right? Hey, hey. Oh my god. Sitting bay plays at me, bro. I'll show real quick. Recover or not. Okay, hold on. Damn, can I recover? Yo, listen. She really trying my reflexes right now. Oh my god, bro. Listen. Let, let me get some damage in. Let me hit you, bro. What are you doing? Oh god. Yo, I'ma need some hit Bobber. Where are you? Someone summon Bobber right now. I need some heals. That's all I need. Just a little bit of heals, man. Really? Okay, we finally found her though. Move though. Can we do something though? Damage, there we go, big damage. Is she gonna cover again? Babbage phase three. Are we going from IG to OnlyFans? Alright, here we go. One again. Damn, you know what? I missed out on this. Oh. Come on, let me get some more of that. There we go. No, never mind. I guess not. I need to change that button. I do not want to walk this often. Oh. There we go, there we go, there we go. Got it. Get some attacks in as much as we can. Save my burst because I know I just am not going to get it off in time. Here we go, dodge that. Okay, didn't dodge that. Oh shit, bro. Hey, did I not die? What? Oh, yo. Oh, yo. Sir, no. Okay. Can we, with this? can we end it? We can. <laughs> Kokomi pops up out of nowhere. Yeah, on your knees. That's right. Bow down to the real baddie. It appears your martial prowess has not dulled. But how long can your will your place. remain strong? How the heck? Uh, surely the Shogun puppet In isn't invisible. Her existence is tenacious indeed. She was built to resist erosion. Her will is stronger than any other living beings, including you and me. So, but cut her in half? Does that mean this is going to be a never-ending battle? Maybe. But I have to prove to her that my present will is no product of erosion. The future I shall forge will be a grand undertaking. One that will be resistant to erosion. 
If I don't do this, the show will never talk shit, girl? change, and Inazuma can never move forward. This gotta get them boomers out of there, dog. Gotta get them out of there. No matter how long this battle may last, months, years, centuries, and no matter how many times we must fight, I will defeat her. Uh, what would happen to Inazuma in the meantime? Good question. Five hundred years ago. Humanity proved their strength in battle. Here in the present, they rely on their ambition to challenge wayward practices, tear them out like the diseased wood of an old sakura tree, so that new, healthy branches might spring to life in their place. So, Thanos snap? It is about time that I learn to trust them. But can you bear to leave humanity to go alone? I guess I, I guess so. That. But if the dreams of which Makoto spoke are true eternity, a short moment for which the Shogun does not exist is nothing to fear. I fight for the everlasting future of Inazuma. However long the battle may last, it is but a drop in the ocean of eternity. Okay. I vow to the subjects of Inazuma that I shall one day return. This is my oath. Wow, oh, I can't believe I was like probably minutes away from this part of the story. I can't believe it took me this long, y'all. It took me this long. It is November 13th, I think, 2022. Pass on my words. We got you, Chief. We got you. Long live the Chief. But man, that was such a good scene, y'all. I swear, if only like, I feel like, like we, we had more of that out. in there. More peak story from Genshin. Oh, I'd still be an addict, dude. Are we really just gonna leave A and the Shogun to keep on duking it out in there forever? I mean, well, that's what she sense. wants. And maybe this is the only way to change the Shogun's rules, but still. A has no physical body anymore and has to rely on the Shogun. This cannot be the only way. That does kind of suck, bro. Um. Right? Also, A can be pretty stubborn at times and has a history of rushing into difficult situations. I mean, I didn't say it was the smartest thing ever, but hey. She's too obsessed with winning, and she forgets why she's there in the first place. It could happen. And then she might never We're not that. about to leave her just yet. A work here isn't done. I mean, can we say work here is done? I mean, she gave us our orders like, hey, ma'am, yes, ma'am. On my way. Bye. Good luck with that. Yeah, we should help her out like we did last time. The quicker she gets through this, the better. So this is how it turns into a weekly uh, battle. Way we can cut down how long she needs to spend in there or, you know. Yep. So this is how we get into the weekly fight. Um. Well, whatever. We can't let anything bad happen to A while she's in there. Oh, but we also can't get in there. And okay, well. We gotta find a way back in. Oh, come, come on, Brian. Right. Yes. <laughs> the on key timing can be, um, uh. Okay, maybe if we both ran into it at the same time really, really hard. Genshin's like, I don't know. Genshin's like the ex I'm trying to like fall back in love with because I think like I still have so much love for Genshin Impact. Oh, you're right. And it's kind of coming back to me, man. Either. It's like the fact that I'm not streaming it. I think streaming oh, has no, killed really so many things for me. That. Realm. It feels good to like just relax, just me, not worrying about. I mean, not necessarily worry about entertaining, just like really taking time to just enjoy um, the game itself is something I really needed. And uh, it's kind of weird not even having a face cam, but um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to. Uh, like I said, really fall back into love with like just the process of just like, I don't know, playing Genshin and just like thinking about like different Genshin content I want to go ahead and do. Amiko! Someone's not in the best of moods. Hmm, let me guess. I want to go back to a more relaxed, natural state when it comes to contemplation. You need me to unravel it for you. I hope you realize how lucky you are. If it was anyone else, I don't think I'd have to. This is gonna sound weird, but like said, fuck it, dude, we're going there. The All right. Times. I know a lot of people like. 
that love was a like Yamiko, but I never got it. I don't know. Is it what's the name? Is it Yamiko? Yamiko? I don't know, dude. See, I don't know how to pronounce her name. It's been a long time, y'all. I'm sorry. Y'all gotta have to go ahead and get me right, all right? Y'all gotta correct me when it comes to a lot of things, bro. But uh, don't be afraid to go ahead and help brother out, man. I, I won't get offended, promise, probably. But I won't curse you in the comments. I'll do it like just casually in my head, okay? Um, Pi Man, get to the point. You know what? I can say that about so much dialogue in this game. Insert care to name, get to the point. Isn't that like just. Isn't that something you've wanted to say so many times? I can't be the only one who on like numerous occasions I've gone to like just that line right there. Such as such, can you get to the point? Can you stop giving me word spaghetti? All right. And give me the meat of what the fuck is going on, bro. Can you not talk to me in poems? Can you talk to me like a normal person, please? Um, It's always been one of my criticisms when it comes to this game, but uh, it's just kind of funny. I saw that line. I was like, relatable. Oh, yeah, yeah. Something really big happened. It's a she. She's fighting her in the demons, man. Tell you, Miko, about everything that has happened. Oh, okay, I see. So, Ace decided to palm Inazuma off on the humans. Yeah. While she goes off on her own to fight a fierce battle that doesn't even have an end date. Yeah. Impossibly stubborn jumps straight to the most extreme course of action imaginable, presumes her sheer will can see her through, despite a near impossible goal that requires nothing short of the very peak of her abilities. <laughs> yes, that sounds like A, all right. Spidden. <laughs> you know as well as I do that she's always been like this. Why start fretting about it now? Um, uh, this was more serious than anything up until now. I mean, kind of, yeah. I mean... You know, uh, a fight without an expiration date sounds kind of like a nigga moment, y'all. Rushed into it without thinking. That's exactly what happened. Well, a got herself into a nigga uh, moment. She acts like such a child. And sometimes. she needs someone to bring her so back to the side of sanity. Under the impression that I am able to offer some sort of help. Who gave you that idea? Um, I mean, if you don't help, I don't really care. To be honest with you. Uh huh. You're learning, little one. But really, the truth of the matter is that I don't know much more about Raiden Makoto's realm of consciousness than you do. All I know is that it's the foundation of the sacred Sakura. And from what I've heard, it's a little different from A's plane of euthymia. Because Raiden Makoto is no longer alive? Yeah, Not surely. just because of that. The nature of the space itself is different in some way. But I can only speculate. You're the ones I wasn't paying attention. Video. Relatable. So me. Anyway, we needn't worry <laughs> about the details too much. It'll just be a little difficult to explain things later on, that's all. First things first, follow me to the entrance. Now then, I always have my ways. It's just a question of how crafty I need to be. To the outsider, the realm of consciousness is a very abstract concept. Luckily, I'm A's familiar, so I can sense her rough whereabouts. In okay, words, um, even though I can't yeah, do that. the exact spatial location of this realm, I can still send you to where A is. Oh, shit. Yo, bitch, you like an Apple AirTag? It's abstract, but has a location, but you don't know where it is. But you, you got like the Find My Master app, don't you? There. Shit, bet. Yes, no need to try and understand it. Let me put this simply. Right now, she is surrounded by chaos. Everything is turbulent and disordered. If you try to force your way in, you could be swept away by a giant wave that sets you down in an unknown corner of space-time. Yeah, sure. This is precisely why when entering the plane of Euthymia, it's much safer if you place your consciousness in a physical object first. Yeah, what? sure. <laughs> All right, well, I might stay here then. You two can go in. You know, I keep it smart. Paimon, you're not gonna abandon me, are you? I know, right? I always thought Paimon was a ride or die. Come on Suit now. Yourself. Worst case scenario, all we stand to lose is A. So what's the big deal? Damn, you ain't a shit familiar, aren't you? Oh, well, if you're quite sure, then of course. Now, I shall send you on your way. 
So this is our first attempt at the weekly boss um solo, I suppose. I say. What is it? Oh, nothing. It just seems extraordinarily chaotic, that's all. My suspicions have been confirmed. By okay. the way, remember to focus constantly on your heartfelt wishes when you enter inside. Only a strong enough will can prevent you from being swallowed by the giant waves of abstract space. Only all right, girl, get to the point. The door is open. Hop on in. God damn, you done said the door is open three, four. Oh my God, bro, can. you done said the door is open three, four times. Anything happens. Let me go. I'm placing my God in your capable hands. Okay, thanks. Bye. For my sake and for Inazuma's, please bring her back. Oh my God, I can't stand girls like you. Rico, you better know what you're doing. That's enough chatter. Legitimately, there are girls like work. that, man. They will act like like shit don't matter to them. And then, like, you know, get really upset when shit happens. <laughs> but they said it doesn't matter to them, so it's like, hey. Ooh, cutscene. Oh my god, this cutscene is sexy, though. Ooh, hit me with the anime vibes. Oh my god. Bro, this is crazy. Look at this. Remember to focus constantly on your heartfelt wishes when you I enter needed more cutscenes like this, bro. Only if you are strong I'd still be pumping that Genshin in my veins, bro. I wouldn't be getting shit done like, bro. I'd be giving me all my cash right now, man. All my credit card numbers, bro. New lines of credit just for getting shit. God, be hell you're going crazy with this. Show me something more. Oh, never mind. I guess we're done. Huh? Hey, welcome back. How can this be? You have returned. But how were you able to get back in? And how come you have not changed at all in all these years? Damn, bro. You've been doing this shit for like years now. This is a duel to remember. It is as if we have returned to the moment when the laws of eternity were first established. Your will today is as strong as it was back then. Over countless battles, not once have you lost, and never have you shown the slightest hesitation. Had I made all enemies of eternity stand against you, you still would not have wavered. For okay. your firm commitment to enforcing the rules, you have my admiration. All right, let's see. Can y'all like not stroke you each other off right now? To the title of Oh my God, Guardian bro. They are literally eternity. stroking each other off right now. Now these two return once more to this space. <laughs> An inevitability of fate, perhaps. Okay. Then, let this be our final duel. The conclusion to that which began 500 years ago. Final duel? So you're finally willing to stand back, traveler. Uh, yo, do you think her? I'm going to be the start of something new. All you really got to do is hit it like one good. God damn. Okay, the same thing. The rise and fall of nations. Right, I'm gonna meet some early hits. Let's go. Oh shit. Hey. Oh my god. Yo, what is this transformation though? Damn, I'm kind of slow though. What's this? Oh my god. Yo, give me some Scooby Snacks. I'm gonna need this, bro. I'm gonna need some Scooby Snacks for this one, bro. She's fucking going wild. Nah, but I do have some food, so I should be okay. Okay, okay. Come on through with it. Oh. There we go. Ooh. Oh my god. Anime. Fuck with it. I like it. Nice little hit. Halfway. Oh. Okay, we're gonna eat something now. Okay. What's next? Okay, I'm not next to you right now. So that's kind of okay. Oh, oh, okay. Jumping mini games. I remember this right here, honestly. Ooh, oh. 
Oh, oh, okay, okay. I should have done something else right there. I'm not sure what but something else maybe. But like, I don't remember like most of this because I only did this like once. And I'm so sad I didn't get to like experience like this for a second. Because I am loving every last bit of this right now. This is the end. You, you have won. won. I believed you were incapable of transcending the past. But it seems my belief was baseless, and I underestimated your spirit. <sighs> but a will that cannot be eroded has no way to embrace the future. You need not worry about the future, and you aren't alone. I know your power more than anyone else. Had I relied upon my strength alone, I would have lost this duel for sure. Yet here she goes. My reason for stroking herself off again. Find my martial prowess and redrew my limits. I now carry the gaze of the myriad of expectant eyes that look to the light in the heavens. What did you just say? <laughs> whenever I think of this. I feel something stirring within Muso Ishin. The blade that I inherited from Makoto seems to be trying to Yeah, that looked five star to me. That looks look, look to too expensive. Me. I noticed it also. Just now, in the heat of battle, it seemed to unleash a new and unfamiliar power. Oh, she got that rank this three five star weapon. All right, she got some. She got some ranks on it. This blade belonged to Makoto. She got some refinement on it. Perhaps it can only respond to me with its full power. When I truly understand and believe in her. I feel like they're legitimately pitching to me like, you know, hey when man, you I gotta get the ranks up, you gotta get that rank six hands. five star weapon for your shogun. Then again, I'm pretty sure this it like mission came out like much, much feeling. after um and a strange one. She was like out of rotation. Makoto barely wielded a blade in her life. And yet, her blade brings me closer to her. You have my approval. Um, okay. Your present will is not the product of erosion. I shall no longer stop you from attempting to modify the rules. From this day forth, this body will remain your assistant. I won't design any more rules that can never be changed. You used to represent my past, but from today onward, you are me. Makoto never saw me as a fearless weapon. Likewise, I should not regard you as a mere tool. Huh. You truly have changed. I suppose this is what humans call growth. Okay. I understand. I shall become your shadow, just as you were once Makoto's shadow. The duties I perform will not change. But as a warrior, I look forward to the chance to fight like this again in the future. So, Yoko now? <laughs> Do you say this because you have not yet reconciled yourself with your defeat? It was simply a new experience for me. One that is worth reliving. Have you finished fighting then? Like, for real this time? I think mm -hmm. so. These motherfuckers find like a married couple, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Musician is glowing. And greetings, those who have come to bear witness. I am oh. Raiden Makoto, the previous Electro oh. Archon, who failed in my duties and left you all to pick up the pieces. Hey girl, how you doing? Makoto? I'm so happy. You've come so far. I always knew you would make it here in the end. I left a faint fragment of my will in Muso Ishin, so that in the moment that you unleashed its full power, I too would be released. <laughs> A convoluted way to reach you, but... Well, you held such deeply entrenched views at the time that you wouldn't have listened to a word I said. Damn, she said you was, was arrogant no and ignorant back in the day. Please Still ignorant as fuck, but I mean, hey, at least you're not ignorant, right? I think. Find some way to wait until you came to me. 
But... You never mentioned this to me. Everything happened so suddenly. I'm sorry. I've always felt terrible for having to entrust Inazuma to you all of a sudden. I should have been the one to impart these ideas to you, a little at a time, to dissuade you from your pursuit of stillness. Did you know what was about to happen in Conria? I had some sense. Oh, what happened in Conria? I kind of forgot. Place, like, I, yo, I need somebody to help me out with the lore, bro. <laughs> I'm so far behind. I'm, I've fallen even but more ignorant to it now than I was before. I can no longer perceive time. I don't know how long we have been separated before this reunion. And I don't know what Inazuma has experienced in the meantime. Nothing, actually. I know that this must have been an extremely arduous journey for you. And I'm sure you must have wanted to shed tears many times along the way. Don't look down on me. <laughs> See? You admit it. It was with this possibility in mind. No, hey, son, that was looking kind of nice. So I don't know. That's just like a weird thing. <laughs> I, <noticed. Something> to <laughs> I was like, yeah, okay, with the painted nails. Here, take it before my last shred of consciousness fades away. Oh, that's kind of sad. But it is you who must take the most important step. And what's that? Cutscene? Oh. No? Yes, maybe? Cutscene! There we go. Huh? <sighs> the light turned into a seed? The miracle tree that blesses the people. In this moment new to the world and yet to be known. When to plant it, where it shall bloom. She who brings it into being must let her heart and dreams decide. Grant it life, eh? Is this... is it really? <sighs> is it... is it really what? Hey, don't jump, look at that. See, look at the nails, man. Eternity extends time into infinity. Dreams illuminate each moment within. When both shine in unison, the sacred Sakura blooms. Oh man, that thing rising up like finally free from the clutches of Never the mind. heavenly principles. Now the nightmare has dissipated, and reality is made whole. The vision we both yearn for is still further ahead. My only regret is that I cannot witness Inazuma's future. Nor can I walk this journey with you. <sighs> Do you know, A? Eh? I am so happy right now. Because my final wish has now come true. Your polearm once protected me from countless calamities. For this, I've always felt indebted to you. Though I could never repay you in full, this sacred Sakura will buy you some time until you are ready to awaken and embrace the new. What do you think? Did it do the trick? <laughs> this time, it really is goodbye, eh? Damn. Man, once again, I feel so bad because like, there is a significant part of me that goodbye, is kind of coming back to me, but a lot of it's lost on me because it's been like so long. Oh man, see, yo, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta keep going, y'all. I gotta keep, I gotta see what's new with Genshin Impact. So the A of the present because the scene right here was like so good. Those like the Genshin the moments I live for. And it took that makes like really fall in like past. love for like the carriages no and everything what else. You make of it, it's quite incredible. All of this is thanks to Makoto's power. Her understanding of eternity is much more profound than mine. Eternity is a concept intimately connected with time. When you begin to touch on eternity, the concept of time becomes murky. A place where time is meaningless and cannot be understood with ordinary logic. Huh, so that was the turbulence I was sensing. Perhaps that is the reason why you were able to return precisely to this point in time without any problems. And yet, that sense of disorderliness has now completely disappeared. 
I don't fully understand yet. But my intuition tells me that the reason for everything, it's that seed. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not convinced that it was Makoto's power alone. Hold on, is this not voice acted? What the heck? I know what you mean. Perhaps a higher power really was involved in all of this, but whatever the explanation, her solution is what saved us all. Without the sacred Sakura, Inazuma would likely have been completely swallowed up centuries ago by that disaster and the filth. I know you've always perceived there was something special about the sacred Sakura, but to me, it has always been there. You've tried in the past to prove to me that there is a connection between the sacred Sakura and Makoto's consciousness. But unfortunately, you never did persuade me, did you? No. But I understand why now. It was because the sacred Sakura hadn't even been planted then. Um, but don't you think that tree looked a lot different than how it does now? The sacred Sakura is within my purview at the shrine, so obviously I get to prune it exactly how I like it. Oh. Ugh. Now we see who's pulling the strings. I'm joking. That tree has been through a okay. lot since it first sprouted. <laughs> we have the loving care of Kitsune over the ages to thank for how it appears today. And obviously I played my part too. It's fair hey. to say so that I guess very we can wrap little this up, time passed between the moment you came out of that realm and the moment you re-entered it. But in that same time, centuries of battling took place on the inside, did it not? Traveler, if I'm guessing correctly, you were repeating your wishes to yourself in your mind, weren't you? Um, is that significant? At that time, I could sense A's whereabouts, but I also sensed anomalies in the flow of time within that space. Suffice to say, time added a whole new dimension to our search. Simply establishing a location was not sufficient. Fortunately, your will was strong enough that the turbulence carried you to the moment in time most likely to be the intersection of all that you were wishing for. The flow of turbulence may well have been influenced by Makoto, but it took everyone's efforts combined to ultimately help A. So this time... It looks like thanks are due to you. Does that mean okay. it wasn't by chance that we ended up at the final <clears throat> duel? We were always meant to be there to witness what was going to happen? I thought that the flow of time was the same on the inside and the outside. So it was a great shock to me when the traveler reappeared. My first thought was... Has a great disaster befallen Inazuma? But it turned out you had come to rescue me. You came for my sake, to help me reach the best possible outcome. You too have my thanks. You have done much for me, and I will never forget it. Hey, Promise, how are you feeling now? My body has fully recovered, and the Shogun's will no longer fights against me. Always thrilled to hear you're in good health. But I was really asking about your emotions. Have you managed to calm Mental down? Health, very important, After very all, important. You saw Makoto in there, didn't you? I only heard her voice. I wouldn't say I saw her. I'll be fine. It brought a few things back, of course. But I've made my decision to move forward. I have to say, this has reminded me once again just how brilliant Makoto was. She predicted all the ways in which Inazuma's future could unfold, all the way back then. <laughs> she even factored my immaturity into her plan. It's all thanks to her that Inazuma lived to see this day. Okay, fine, whatever I she's great. planted a seed. Yeah, it was thanks to everything you did that you got to see her again. Thank you. Today, at long last, you and Inazuma fuck Makoto and you are Inazuma's past and future. It's rare to hear such comforting words from- Oh, God. Makoto said the exact same Damn. thing! Hey, Loki, got it all of Miller a bit, <laughs> Great yo. minds think alike, hmm? I wonder, does that qualify me to, maybe, take the position of Shogun for a couple of days? 
Oh, Actually, I should stay no. trying someone, Forget bro. That. Far more trouble than it's worth. We will have to end the frivolities there. There is much work to be done. You ain't lying, bro. The Shogun and I will talk so much. God damn. Inazuma of today to find out where things currently stand. Then we will give careful consideration to the future. After that, I will. Really? I am no longer. I don't <clears throat> doubt that many challenges lie ahead for Inazuma. I'm looking. For but hey, if you made it this far, I just want to say thank you for watching, man. Unfortunately, we didn't have the camera for this one, but I think I will keep recording and we're going to get deeper into uh, whatever is new with the Genshin Impact story because I've actually really been enjoying it. And if you have too, man, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. But beyond that, I'll see you next time.